Hey everyone, welcome back. Today we're gonna to be working on upper body stretching. I've got five exercises picked out for us, one minute each stretch. We're gonna be using resistance bands here. So one small resistance band that you would use on your legs, just like this, but flexible. This is not a cloth band. It is actually an elastic band. And then one large one that's super duper long so we can get the back and everything like that. All right, so grab your gear if you need gear. I will leave links in the description box down below so you can get these on Amazon. They're super affordable, so check it out there. Before we get started, like, subscribe, and let's get into this. So let's start with a smaller band because we're only gonna be using it for one exercise. Go ahead and bring it into your hands right here, just like this. Bring your arms up or out so you can see here because I'm gonna put my hands up because you can't really see. And we're going to open our arms up. So just like this, but open your arms up. I like to go right above and then do it right here, okay? We're working shoulders, we're working arms, and we're stretching as well. So we're gonna do one minute of this. Let's get started. Try to open up your hands as far as you can, and when you bring them back together, don't let them fly back together. Control the motion of them coming back together. from yesterday you guys <laughs> from the leg from the glute workout you have no idea my legs are like destroyed but that's good Resistance bands are also really good for you if you're not trying to bulk up, you just want to tone. So when you're not trying to bulk your body up with weights and you just want to tone, definitely use some resistance. All right, next we're going to be using our big band. Put it on your feet just like this and we're going to pull our arms out just like that, okay? So this is a stretch for this back area right here. It's also for the arms. It's also for the lower back. So. Take it nice and slow and bring them out as high as you can. You're not gonna be able to bring your arms up maybe to the 90, but you're gonna be able to bring them up as high as you can and lower them back down again. We're also working on flexing the muscles and toning the muscles as we're doing these stretches. So it's kind of like the best of both worlds. Your hands should be in line with your shoulders not too narrow and not too wide. For this next stretch, we're gonna be doing a static stretch. So go ahead and wrap your hand around the band one time. Bring your arm here, just like you would in middle school when they try to make, tell you to touch your hands behind your back when it was easier. We're gonna be doing the same thing, but pulling and holding. So you might have to wrap it around twice if you have a lot of slack like this. Okay, <laughs> how did I do this before? Bend your elbow like this. And then we're going to pull. So we're actually stretching this arm that's going up. So the arm that's up here is the arm that we're stretching. And we're gonna hold it for one minute and then we're gonna go ahead and switch opposite sides and hold, okay? So let's get this done. This is a weird position at first, but I swear, it's really nice. If your shoulder is hurting at all, 
loosen the band a little bit. If you have it wrapped over a couple times like I do, if you're feeling any shoulder pain, go ahead and just loosen one of the levels, so like that, and just continue to pull. You might have it too tight. pulling this one down as well. So this is this should be down so that you have that resistance. All right guys, go ahead and wrap it over one time and we're gonna do the other side. Now we're gonna do the same thing but opposite way. So instead of raising up this arm, we're actually going to pull this arm up. So instead of having this arm down here, resisting this one, we're gonna pull this arm up here so we can stretch the shoulder on this arm. Okay, so this one should be trying, like touching your shoulder blade and we're really trying to pull it up there so that you can get this deep stretch in your shoulder on this side. We're gonna hold it for one minute. And if you want to, if this is too much strain on your arm to hold it up and pull your shoulder, just pull the band over your shoulder and hold it. It's kind of like an extra support. And you're really gonna feel the stretch on this side right here. It's so nice. Great job, and our last stretch, we're gonna do a chest stretch, opening up our arms like this, and just holding it for one minute. So grab your resistance band, stand up nice and tall, back is in, core is flexed, don't pop your butt out, don't arch your back. <laughs> grab your resistance band, open your arms up as wide as you can, and just breathe, we're gonna stand here for one minute. I can touch the ground, touch the ground, it feels like I can see the sands on the horizon every time You are not around, I'm slowly drifting away, drifting away Wave after wave, wave after wave You're gonna 
feel the stretch in your biceps. You're also gonna feel the stretch in your deltoids and shoulders and traps. If you have to take a rest, if, it, if it's straightening or anything, go ahead and take a second and then get right back to it. This is not a workout, this is just a stretch. There's a fly in here, it's making me insane. <laughs> I hate flies. guys and that's it that's all for today don't forget click that subscribe button smash that like button and I'll see you tomorrow bye